I'm now going to explain to you what the, the basic problem with this type of panel uh, is that came out in its era in the 80s, uh, known by, again, CEB, Commander, Sylvania, etc., is the fact that it's a bolt-on breaker, and a lot of times a bolt-on breaker with these little screw terminals are only as good as the person that's installing it. So, again, what can happen is... Well, recently we were called here to uh, troubleshoot a circuit breaker that was overloading and while well, tripping out, okay? So basically, it wasn't really a, a, an issue of too much draw coming through the circuit from a, a vacuum, but more so the breaker deteriorating. Uh, in particular, if you look up top there, I've since removed the screw that snapped off, but it's over, it overheats where the breaker bolts on to the bus bar and burns out right at that point right up in here so you can see that okay so what we've done is just temporarily remove move relocated that circuit down onto here uh, onto a lighter circuit just temporarily until we get this panel swapped out but what happens is once this starts to happen you get some arcing and you get some carbon buildup and then basically ultimately the breaker will no longer be able to even handle even a couple of amps so some people could be confused by the fact that they're having problems on the circuit, but in fact, it is the panel itself and the design of the panel. This is still manufactured by Cutler Hammer. I don't recommend it because the same thing can continue to happen. Uh, we've got a newer breaker down there at the bottom right for the central air. But even if you look up top here on another breaker that we haven't even you know, had problems with, as of yet, but they're very likely to. You can see another terminal overheating right at the very top left, right there. So ultimately that's going to fail as well. This type of panel actually was very famous for having the main breaker burn out. Sometimes from the, even, the inside out to the bus bar where it bolts on, particularly because all, the, all of the load is coming going throughout this 100 amp breaker. So naturally you're gonna have more, gonna, you're gonna have more current and you're gonna have more heat and uh, it's gonna fail there. But this one here actually seems to be okay. So, main issues here are a couple of branch circuit breakers in the load center. I've actually seen a lot worse than this uh, prior to the days of me having a, a little video camera on my cell phone. But this is the panel that we're gonna swap out. Uh, I'm limited with slack up there on the, uh, the mains coming in, so we'll have to try to get the new panel positioned in, um, in a similar fashion one that can fit in this uh, existing cupboard. So there you go. That's uh, This is the problem with the, the CEB Sylvania Commander. Uh, there's the cover down over there. So if you have this manufacturer in your home or your property, again, uh, it came with white breakers as well, I recommend you have it swapped out. At least have it checked out, make sure you don't have any overheating going on because that's exactly what it looks like right there on the bus bar. Ciao.